Here they are for the 14th race. Number one is Lock and Load, owned by Tasmanian Stables with Bob Harper up. Two is Jim Kelly, owned by Tim Woodall with Dave Hawk. The three is Goal, owned by Stevens and Osara Eliadeden. Four is Call Me Nuke, owned by Ron Gorby with Jack Daly. Five, Showtime Clyde, owned and driven by Hugh McCann. Six is Cole Tomar, owned by Long and Long, Chip Noble. Seven, Maximum Revenge, is owned by Gary Adams, the driver Jeff Nysonger. Eight is Sulan Big Chief, owned by Eilert and King. Greg Grismore up. Nine is out, and the ten is Majestic Glance. And by Douglas Riston with Justin Hall. That's your field. Fourteenth race, seven minutes away. Pacers are lined up for the 14th and final race tonight at Scioto Downs. And they're off. Call Me Nuke goes out to grab the lead. Sulan Big Chief left from the outside and will look to duck into the pocket. Lock and load comes away in third. It's a gap of two farther back. Majestic Lance is racing in fourth position. Jim Kelly is fifth. And then we have Goal in sixth. Another two more to Showtime Clyde, followed by Cole Tomar, and Maximum Revenge is the early trailer as they roll to head stretch with Call Me Nuke leading the way. Call Me Nuke in 28 and 2 is leading the parade past the grandstand for the first time. Just in behind, Sulan Big Chief skims the cones in second. The rail ride for Lock and Load third, Majestic Glance remains at the pylons in fourth. Jim Kelly is racing in fifth. Goal is sixth and looking for cover. And then we come down to Showtime Clyde, Cole Tomar up alongside, and Maximum Revenge is last as they move around the clubhouse turn with Call Me Nuke dictating the fractions in here. Just in behind is Sulan Big Chief, and here's Justin Hall. First over with Majestic Glance on the outside third, the half, 58-3. and three. Along the rail, Lock and Load is racing in fourth position. Jim Kelly is off the cones, but retreating. And then we have Showtime Clyde, followed by Goal. And then it's Cole Tamar and Maximum Revenge. Five sixteenths of a mile remaining as they head for the far turn. Call Me Nuke remains unopposed on the lead. Has it by two. From Sulan Big Chief in second. Lock and load third. Majestic Glance is fading on the outside fourth. Three quarters in 127 flat. Moving around to head stretch. And Call Me Nuke widens the advantage to three lengths now. Sulan Big Chief could not stay with him. Lock and Load is looking to rally on the outside in third, followed too farther back by Showtime Clyde in fourth, coming inside the final 16th. It's Call Me Nuke on top by three. Lock and Load is closing, but Call Me Nuke goes on to score wire to wire. Lock and Load up second, Sulan Big Chief third, Showtime Clyde was fourth in 155 and three. Back to the winner's circle is Call Me Nuke, fourth victory on the season, an eight-year-old bay gelding by Nuke's image out of Abercary by Abercrombie, owned by trainer Ron Gorby of St. Mary's, Ohio. Jack Daly is the winning driver, 155 and three. For one exacta, returns $51.80. Super, 4185, 2,250.40. And three of three in the pick three, $79.80.